many Belmont residents have been waiting impatiently and eagerly for the completion of the new high school construction to be over. In September 2021, they will be stepping into this wonderful new modern building that will take Belmont into the 21st century. Belmont will have its first zero net energy building complete with no fossil fuels. All heating and cooling coming from 283 geothermal wells that were drilled 500 feet deep to tap into the natural resources under our feet. This is Nune in Boston area homes. If you are thinking of relocating to the Boston area, please download my relocation guide in the description box below. And consider subscribing because every week I bring you important information about buying and selling real estate and enjoying life in the Boston area. Belmont is only 20 minutes from downtown Boston. It is an easy commute. Because of plenty of public transportation options, there is commuter rail, there is the bus uh, to Harvard Square, then you can take the train, you can also take the bike to Ellawife Station in Cambridge and take the train from there to anywhere in Boston. Belmont is a cute small suburb that offers excellent blue ribbon schools, consistently ranking high in all the school rankings in Massachusetts and the US. My children graduated in 2019 and right after that the construction started. The construction crew was there day in and day out, even through the pandemic, through 2020, they kept going. The construction is planned in phases. Phase one is gonna finish um, in a month or two to be uh, ready for the high school to open its doors for September 2021. Phase two is when the existing, the old high school building will be demolished and that's starting sometime any day, July 2021. And that will provide the space for the new middle school to be erected in its place. The new middle school will serve grades 7 and 8. The completion of the middle school is scheduled for 2023. So in September 2023, the 7th and 8th graders can go to the new modern middle school. The new building will be completely different from the old layout. It will have more of a college feel than a high school feel. It will have more open space, more natural light coming through big windows and through the middle of that building. It will have more flexible spaces such as the cafeteria and the library. Those areas will be open through the central portion of the building rather than being in confined rooms. There are adjacent classrooms throughout the building that have operable walls that allow for combined classes, affording multidisciplinary learning. There is a new auditorium, new band and orchestra and chorus rooms, all designed to today's modern standards. The existing pool will have a completely new look. There will be pool lockers, a new fitness room, and new locker rooms. In two years, there'll be a new art space with direct access to the outdoors and plenty of natural light. The project has retained the old gym called the field house, small gym, and the pool structure. However, all three spaces will see dramatic renovations and complete makeovers. Middle schoolers will share the cafeteria and the library with the high school, but will be there at different times and use a designated space for just the middle school. Please like and subscribe and watch my next video, which is about Belmont, Massachusetts.